Hey everyone, I'm going to talk about how to get a diplomatic victory in Civilization VI Gathering Storm. This latest expansion for Civilization VI actually adds in a whole new victory in the diplomatic one. To sum up how to win it, you basically need diplomatic victory points. You essentially will not be able to win with this victory until after the modern era. You see, starting in the medieval era, there are these things called resolutions that will start happening every 30 turns. But the one that matters for this victory is the one that happens after the modern era. It will be called the Diplomatic Victory Resolution, and it's going to basically have people voting for who the world leader is. You'll get a victory point if you're awarded the world leader, and when you get 10 victory points, you will have won the Diplomatic Victory. How do you get victory points? How can you vote for yourself? Well, it's very simple. You need more favor. Favor is what's going to allow you to vote for yourself and beat out every other civilization that's basically voting for themselves. In order to get more favor in the game, you need to have alliances, you need to be suzerain for a lot of city-states, you need to liberate city-states, or you need to participate and succeed in scored competitions and emergencies. When you conduct first aid, when you're helping other civilizations, when you're positive to other civilizations, when you trade for favor with other civilizations, you're going to accumulate more and more diplomatic favor. If you're going for a diplomatic victory, you might as well hoard all these favors up until the diplomatic victory resolution appears and start using your favors to vote for yourself. Again, you need to outvote everyone else in the diplomatic victory resolution in order to be awarded a victory point. When you do that and you accumulate 10 points, you are gonna be the world leader. You're gonna have won the diplomatic victory in Civilization VI Gathering Storm. Now there is another way to get victory points that don't involve voting for yourself using your favor. Sometimes, rarely, we notice that if you play in any of the scored competitions or any of the emergencies, the reward might be diplomatic victory points. This happened very rarely though. The more secure way of getting these points is by outvoting everyone else in those resolutions that will start happening after the modern era every 30 turns. Get those 10 diplomatic victory points and you'll be good to go. That's all there is to it. That's how you win a diplomatic victory in Civilization VI Gathering Storm. If we helped you out, please leave a like. If you have any other questions, leave a comment down below. And thank you for watching.